Dracula. Die now and leave this world. You'll never belong here. Oh, but this world invited me. Your own kind called me forth with praise and tribute. Tribute? You're a thief. You steal men's souls, their freedom. Freedom is always sacrificed to faith, good hunter. Or are you truly here by choice? All I'm here for is you. To hell with your heresy! You're nothing but a blight on mankind. Ha! Mankind. A cesspit of hatred and lies. Fight for them, and die for their sins! <laughs> shaft to menace humanity once again. The legendary vampire hunter, Richter Belmont, stood against him and at last brought him down. However, four years later, on a glaring full moon night, Richter mysteriously vanished. Maria Renard set out to find him, but knew not where to begin. It was then that fate intervened. Castlevania, the castle of Dracula, rumored to appear once every century, suddenly materialized from the mist, as if to show her the way. Meanwhile, powerful forces struggled for the soul of a man named Alucard. He who had once fought alongside Trevor Belmont against his own immortal father, Count Dracula himself. To purge the world of his own cursed bloodline, Alucard had submerged his vampiric powers and fallen into what was meant to be eternal slumber. But now, he awakens to the cackles of evil and cries of the innocent. The eternal battle of good and evil has come full circle once more. Dracula's castle beckons for you. And no man can say who will emerge victorious. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, that's just wonderful. I thought I'd been talking this whole time, and I hadn't. Makes me feel great about myself. Okay, okay. We'll just we'll just start talking from here. The first part of the stream was just all the good parts. Whatever, it's fine. I'll, I'll live. I'll, I'll make it. Would you get off my stairs? Thanks, Pendo. Oh, I can't believe I wasn't talking. I can't believe my mic was not turned on. I thought it was turned on, but it wasn't turned on. Alright, enough of that uh, echo room there. I just want to make sure it was working and turned on, because it was not previously. <sighs> oh, these creepy puppets. Well, at least I know now, and, you know, I can correct that. I don't think you stream with no volume. Ooh, smart potion. I'll give my chat one guess what that does. Chat, what does that do? Oh, I'm the only viewer in chat, that's right. It uh, raises your intelligence. Beard orb. Oh yeah, you hear that tryhard driving past my house? Super cool. I wish I had a car like that, so I could be super cool too. Yay, Castlevania! good for XP early on. It's pretty easy to kill. You a lot of serious damage, though. Yeah, yeah. Also, you drop one of these iron ball things, and they're pretty strong, but, like, the consumable items are kind of whack in this game, because they're very hard to come by, and, like, sure, they're strong, but, like, you get, like, two of them unless you get the uh, duplicator, and that's like, ridiculously way late in the game, so kind of redundant. Yeah, stuff that's just as or more powerful than the stuff you got, like weapon-wise, or you yourself would be just as powerful. It's like the only one I really use is the power of Sire because uh, you can clear rooms pretty easy, and it makes uh, grinding late game. Uh, I'm not gonna say a walk in the park, but definitely a lot easier than it would be if you were just using like the Chris Grim by itself or something. Because the uh, they call the Guardians. And like right in, right in the middle of the map in the reverse castle, they yield like a decent chunk of XP, but they take quite a bit to uh, whittle down. Their armor is really tough. Like if you got the Chrysogram for sure, you can just run back and forth and just spam that shit. But down I go. Right, I'm just gonna get one more level up off this guy, and then we'll move on. Oh, we have a Cthulhu demon down there or some shit. And we'll be back out by the entrance, but that's cool. He survived. What's that give me? Okay, yeah, that's a nice chunk of XP. It's like 80 XP somewhere around there. That's that. Okay. Let's continue. These guys are tough. Do a lot of damage. And if you like, let them start spamming those boomerangs. It's over. This is 
go infinitely spawn here. Oh, no. Uh, let's put that uh, short sword back on. There we go. 51. Let's kill one ghost and see what it gives us. 449. Yeah, no. Not two experience points. Nope. You can keep that, sis. Uh-uh-uh. You -uh. didn't say the magic word. There he is. Goodbye. Three, four, seven. Come back and kill him again and see if I get a little more. Out of that. Three, four, seven. I'm gonna remember three, four, seven. It's another tricky jump right here. I don't think I can make it. I'll give it a go though, since I gotta go down that way anyway. Two four seven. Oh, that's a hundred experience points a pop. Yes, sir. What level are we? Nine. Pop a couple levels out of that. Bit. Nah, we'll just get one level. Okay, I promise. Just one level, and we'll continue on. Walk about this bitch. Outside of this front side of the alchemical lab, back on through till we get back. So, we oh yeah, have bloody zombie guy. So here's the jump that I'm not gonna make. Uh, when I get the wolf spirit after we get to the uh, outer wall, I can come back and I can kind of cheese this jump. If you run a little bit from that side and jump up, kind of. Yeah, no way I was gonna make it right there. I don't even think I can clear the gaps I try, but let's try it, let's go. Yeah, you can cheese it from right here, you come running up this way, and as you do, you can build velocity, and it's kind of like a glitch jump, like super jump. I still don't think I'm, I'm going to be able to clear the gap, but I'll try. I'll give it one more go. I'm not going to waste a bunch of time here. Oh, just barely. All right, we'll try one more time because that looked nice. Yes. Yeah.
Okay, chat. Uh, Dave, I am gonna go on mute for a while because my wife is drunk. Yeah, Melinda, when I show you this video later, when I show you this clip that I'm making right now, um, you are fucked up. I don't think you think you are, or you think maybe you think you're a little fucked up, but you are really fucked up right now. Drink a whole bottle of wine. And there you are creeping around with uh, some Milano cookies and an ice cold Coca-Cola. Downloaded it to the people. People are awesome. <laughs> For the people. The people of the sun. We got got. <laughs> That's an axe lord, thank you very much. What? An axe fight?
And now we take the route we didn't take before. Trick with these guys, just turn around once. Let's slash them. Let's see if I can do it again. Now that I said it, it's not gonna work. Watch. Oh, I got him! Sweet. I always wondered if there was some significance to this clock right here. Because it's like different colored. Nothing. I mean, maybe. Wait. Are you human? What are you doing oh, here? Her voice actor sounds irritating. Likewise. I'm Maria. And you are? I mean, before she sounded Alex. dumb, but now she just sounds irritating. If you're a better swordsman than a speaker, perhaps I'll see you again. Farewell.
Okay, so here is a secret that I know that a lot of people don't know, I guess. Like, uh, none of my friends knew it, and when I talk to people about this game, nobody ever seems to know this trick. But if you stand right here in this little spot for about 20 seconds, we'll see, we'll count it down here. Um, a little, a little uh, scene will happen, and there's an item you can get much earlier in the game that will help out a lot in the next coming fights. That's uh, a little elevator there. All you gotta do is stand there, and you get the Jewel Knuckle and the Mirror Curious, which protects you from being petrified, which comes in handy, and it's much stronger than the equipment you got right now. See, we got the Hide Curious. Look at that. It goes up by a whole other point of defense, and it protects you from petrification. And then you get the Jewel Knuckle, which, oh, 11 to 25, look at that. Oh my goodness. It's amazing. Let's throw on our sunglasses and kick some ass. And, dope. you just take the elevator back up. So you can't get here until you go to the Colosseum and beat the Werewolf. And come back here, the Werewolf and the Minotaur, because you can't get through here without Mist. And that's where that room where that stuff is. Yeah, so there we go. Little secret. Over your to myself. All right, let's do this doppelganger fight. Never understood why it was the Mayan calendar that the doppelganger comes out of, but whatever, it's cool. See, and this dude has his stupid knives and sword, and since we got the jewel knuckle, we can ninja kick his ass. You're playing, you're fighting the doppelganger himself. Yep. Look at that. Four hits already dead. That's what that jewel knuckle does right there. Bah! Kick him in his face. Ah! 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 Ninja kick the damn rabbit. <laughs> What's up? Ding, ding, ding. Yeah. Alright, break time. Was that the whole boss fight? I'll, that bitch. I'll take that twenty-five dollars, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Pasco would be like twenty-five. <laughs> Is that the symbol for the band him? I maybe I think maybe. <laughs> Castlevania had it first. When did when did him make I music? Know, I never listened to that shit. I mean, either. I don't even know what it is. I'm just guessing. Sounds I only like... know it because it's a pentacle. Pentacle, but it's not a pentacle because it's a heart. You know, crap. Sounds like some emo crap. Yeah, 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 yeah! Ah, runes fall out of nowhere and you get Gebo and Ingwaz. So we got the gift of fucking... <laughs> the gift of fucking... Literally! <laughs> ah! 
I'm gonna let you listen to all this tomorrow. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> that's literally what... Little Lily. It's little Lily. It's little Lily. Little Lily. Keyhole. Yeah, the teleporters around the castle. Is that the skeleton keyhole? I guess. Each one has a different symbol on it. See how that one had the horse, the other one had a scorpion, I think? What did that say? Heart mean what? Heart max up. Oh, okay. Yay, and that opens this pathway up. You have to wait for them to go all the way down. Please. No, oh. you don't. I just, I just like to. It's OCD crap. I feel like I'm playing with my ball set. He's <laughs> shuffling these rooms. Fortunate you don't have to. <laughs> Yeah, that's the scorpion. Alright. Pagalas. Sounds like you're clearing your throat. Pagalas. Ricola. <laughs> Ricola. Those are sweet, aren't they? Probably. Right, people. Oh, you know, the problem with see-through rooms is when you're drunk is like a lot of effort to see which one's upside down and which one's right side up. Gotta follow. Ah, oh, I can make that jump. Bones tell me nothing. <laughs> Alright there, hi, Elwin. Oh, no, it's the wheel. Oh, did you see that clutch jump? Oh my god, I totally cheated. That was beautiful. Cheaty bastard. The ancestors aren't happy with getting drunk, but I don't understand why. They're all. F in the chat, I need another beer. Let's see. Let's go to the long library. Oh shit. Kingfisher fish. Kingfisher. Bird. Yeah, that's a bird. 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 Also, with the fucking irises, which did ah. you know, the irises represent Osiris, which makes sense. Iris, Osiris, but like I associate him with Eindol. Eindol. Kind of. Because Iris Germanica is obviously a German reference, and there's a lot of other shit right now that I can't remember, but like Iris Germanica. Iris Germanica. Kind of. Which makes sense for that it would be so easily because it's like the sun, so you can't have a rainbow without a sun, right? Yeah. I mean, Mr. Rainbow. He's, he's the Norse version of the Archangel Michael. They're very different entities, for sure. I'm not going to say they're the same thing, because that's just fucking blasphemous. But they're very similar. They have a lot of the same things as traits. So it would make sense that you would be the sun, which, you know, obviously the son of makes sense, you know? The son. Oh shit! It's a clear way. The rain has the rainbow, and then there's like that. Ooh! It's like the same thing with Time Ball. You need the rainbow. Party time. Say what? Hey, knowledge. Is it like the letter C? <laughs> the ocean C? Or is it like the Spanish C? <laughs> Which tell. one is it? C. <laughs> <laughs> you are fucked. 
Oh. Oh, Fergus. Yeah. Just don't let me leave the candles going. Because apparently I'm not good at blowing out candles. Do you think I'm gonna trust the young person with the candles? I mean, I know you don't like blowing out the beauty candles, which I appreciate. Which I appreciate. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, what'd you just turn into? A wolf. Listen. <laughs> yeah, you can kind of cheese shit with a wolf. I like, like that little like, glitch though you have there. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, if you get angles, you can like jump mad high. See that shit? I like that. You can get places you're not supposed to get to, like, early. Oh. See that spot up there? Ah, off me! Why is, why is the spell book attacking you for $25? 25, Do you owe him money? $25? It's because it, dro it dropped money. That's, uh, that's, that's what it dropped. <laughs> Where's why is my the money, bitch? Why is this? Well, look, it's knocking you for twenty-five dollars. <laughs> Cause I'm in a library. That's why I I forgot to return it. It's been a long time. Let me. Long time, old white master Adokar. Come to visit. Let's see how how much this dialogue has changed. Twenty-five dollars. Oh, but young master, I could never betray the good count. Cool. <laughs> Sick! Tell me what you need. I'll be on the way. I got this for the I'm coming with the spell because the pages are prohibited. Wrong song, my dear. <laughs> Wrong the hell song. My page is limited. Name <laughs> <laughs> Devil, I'm a okay, rebel. Don't worry the about the attention. <laughs> Did I fail to mention that my special C suspension? <laughs> I am the chosen one. No, no need, need to hold a gun. gun. Take it in like it is Ghostbusters. What the fuck? <laughs> no. No. Why did you <laughs> kill the middle of a reading? Because you stopped. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. I can't read this shit. I can't even fucking read the runes right now. I'm gonna take a picture of it. And then read it later and go get me a beer. <laughs> you go get me. Video. I have to go get some beers, chat. I'll be right back. Don't, don't, don't worry. I'll Who's be back. Chat? I'm chat. I'm the only viewer. I'm talking to myself. Uh, Listen, you have to put out a present. I'm not putting out shit. No, you're not. I know. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, chat, I need to go get some beers. Okay, I'll be right back. I'll be right back, my number one viewer, my number one fan. Number one victory right now. Mr. Doug, you're yeah, the best. Forget, forget. Always watching. <laughs>
Welcome aboard, O oh Prince. Shall I guide thee across the river?
Okie dokie, I am going to call it for the night on this uh, stream here. So, thank you for me watching, and that was fun. Bye! Bye! Bye.